guys welcome back to my channel today i'm talking about my favorite product in the whole entire world if you guys have been watching my channel for a while you won't even be surprised i'm talking about none other than the ordinaries niacinamide this product guys it does wonders for dark spots it does wonders for hyperpigmentation it is multi-purpose this video is not sponsored by the way so i just wanted to put it out there these are my honest opinions it's my honest thoughts i've been using this product for two years now i would say and this is the reason why my skin is somewhat clear don't get it twisted though i still do have dark marks but it was so much worse before i started using this product so that's basically what i'm gonna talk about today let's jump right into it okay so my face is washed my lips are ashy so guys you want to listen up to the instructions because they are very very important if you kind of like don't follow the instructions you can cause yourself irritation so what i tend to do is i take literally two or three drops from the bottle i try not to let the pipette touch my skin one two and three three drops that's all you need right guys so what you want to do is you want to pat it into your skin you don't want to start rubbing it like it's a cleanser rubbing it like it's moisturizer it is not it's a serum so you want to just pat it into your skin this is how it dries it doesn't feel sticky at all it's literally like absorbed into my skin so you don't even have to worry about that sticky feel that you get within like the first few seconds it absorbs nicely okay so this product can be used day or night i just use it at night time just because it's a lot easier for me it really does not matter you can use it morning and night time for me personally i do use it just once because i feel like that's enough for my skin but the most important tip for this product is do a patch test before you use this because what works for my skin is different to what works for your skin and everyone else that's on youtube telling you about their skincare routine so make sure you do a patch test they highly recommend doing it i did a patch test myself that's how i knew that this product was fine it wasn't going to irritate me so make sure you do a patch test listen carefully guys this tip is very important put sunscreen on please if you put serums on acne treatments on active acids active ingredients it can make your skin sensitive towards the sun's uv rays so when you go out in the sun it's gonna do opposite effect basically like for me i'm very much guilty of this i used to wear all these like active ingredients acids and everything and then i would go out in the sun with no sunscreen on and that's when i started to notice that my acne was gone like my acne was going but then the dark marks were getting darker that was like a big concern for me that was the big red flag and then i was like oh my goodness like this is basically because i'm not wearing sunscreen so make sure you put sunscreen on when you're using this please so when you saw me putting this onto my skin so you basically don't want this dropper touching your skin because when it touches your skin it's going right back into the bottle that you're getting the product from so you're basically contaminating whatever's in here with like acne or like dirt or just anything of that sort so make sure that you're trying to be as sterile as possible when you're using this and another thing is you need to give these products enough time to work you guys a lot of people i'm not mentioning names so a lot of people do come to me and say i've been using this for three weeks and it's not doing nothing for my skin what's happening typically you need to be using these products for at least six to eight weeks for you to notice a difference your skin needs time for it to react to these ingredients so make sure you're using it with a thought in the back of your head that i need to be patient i need to be patient because it will start to work after six to eight weeks like for me my skin got worse before it got better they call this purging purging is basically when your skin is turning over so your cells are turning over and all those pimples and the dead skin is basically shedding to unravel clear skin if that makes sense i'm gonna probably put something here that explains it better because i'm not explaining it well another thing is don't put it on broken skin if you have like little cuts on your skin if you have any type of irritation on your skin don't use it just wait till it's healed because you're gonna cause irritation and it's gonna sting i myself have done that that's why i'm telling you 
guys it will sting and it will ruin your day like for me i just I'm, my pain threshold is ridiculous so that's why like i'm saying to you that don't put it on broken skin not only does it hurt it can just cause further irritation so just make sure your skin is completely healed before you use this so also when i'm doing my skincare routine this is probably just like a general tip i take everything that i do on my face to my neck because what you don't want is your face brighter than your neck i just bring it down to my neck like that so this is another tip when you apply your niacinamide just allow it to like soak into your skin this is what i do i just sit here waste a few minutes and just allow it to soak in before i go in with the rest just because i feel like it seeps in to my skin like nicely so the reason why you want to just let it sit in is because you want to let the product absorb into your skin really nicely so niacinamide is actually so good at retaining moisture so if you've got like dry skin like like for me my skin is so ridiculous like i have like an oily t-zone and like my outer layer is like ridiculously dry so what i used to struggle with is using nice and mine because i was like will it dry out my skin because it controls your oil production so i was like oh my goodness will it dry out the rest of my skin and no it doesn't do that because it retains the moisture make sure that you're applying a moisturizer like a nice moisturizer moisturizer makes sense and then going in with an oil to seal that moisture that's like the key to making sure you're really really hydrated so me i just just going with like a vitamin e oil like you can literally use any oil of your choice so that's it you guys that's a little bit about niacinamide so if you are really struggling with dark marks and hyperpigmentation get yourself some niacinamide this really does change the game for me the ordinary have so many different other products for hyperpigmentation but so far this is the one that's worked for me right, thank you guys so much for watching this video that's a little bit about niacinamide if you have any questions let me know in the comment section i will definitely get back to you on that so yeah.